Hey, it's KMA, how's your day today? And welcome to the corner. As you see, <laughs> as always, this is Mr. Craft, and it's always raining. And as you see, I am completely naked. And why is that? Because last time I logged off, I was AFK, and what I do is I AFK up here sometimes to get some bones from down there, and I got struck by lightning, and when I logged back in, I was dead. Dead. Again. No matter how safe you think an area is, no matter how sound and, and mob-free an area will be, things like lightning and things like that happen, even when you think you are protected particularly safe and not gonna get hurt you still throw your stuff into a chest guys i had a beacon and stuff on me you know all my good stuff you know how upset i would be if i had lost all that i think i'd know what fcd feels like jab sorry that was bad sorry <laughs> <laughs> but anyways, let's get on to, with the show. I plan on doing some work to that tree. Um, I'm going to have to make this whole area different. I had started to add where I th was thinking of putting some item sorters because I got to get a item elevator from down there to bring stuff up here. But I'm thinking of just redoing this whole platform. And hopefully that doesn't mean I have to replace the... Il Mango Super Smelter and a string on the outside. Oh, that's probably from when I killed something. <laughs> you jerk face. There we go. Let's check out our goods. Let's steal some XP. I have no idea how much XP I had before I died, but it doesn't really matter. We got some farms here to get XP quick. Let's see how long I actually made it before I died. Oh, looks like I was on a fairly long time. Good. So, um, I need to... Get the bone supplies at least. I'm gonna throw that in there. And I am gonna go to something I did on a stream, and which is why you need to watch some of my streams because um, not everything that I do on the server is done in a video, guys. You know, up top right there in the corner of the video, there's a place you can go and watch me do things like uh, make bone shops. Yes, I made a bone shop in my last stream. So let us go check it out. Ready? One, two, three, go. A row and we will go, a row and we will go. I hold the Mary, a row and we will go. Hey, Woofer. We are going to the shopping district, which is right here. Imagine that. Stop on a dime. Gotta love those breaks. Um, so this is the shopping district, and people have a whole bunch of great little shops and things here. You can get a whole bunch of stuff, but over here, um, we have something that I have made for my shop. And I guess I could still do the path to it, but um, yeah, I guess I'm really going to have to do a path to it. And I've started like loading up some bones here. And I gotta set this up. I gotta find out where I'm gonna put a pay chest. Maybe just like right there. I don't know. You can maybe I should just replace the di the bone blocks with diamonds. I don't know. I'll figure it out. Let me uh, make a couple of signs and uh, get this stuff made up into good stuff. Let's get get get. I need some inventory space. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go AFK a little bit more and get some more bones. Get this, get the shop uh, filled with stuff and things and then announce it on the Discord that this is ready to go. I guess make a, a line to the shop. Hmm. And I believe I'm just going to sell these one diamond per stack. Yeah. So um, let me get a little bit busy. And uh, I'll be back with you.
All right, I have finished what I needed to do with the shop. Um, I kind of extended this and this pathway, and I know it goes right to me, but in this whole area, I mean, the path can go like this way and stuff like that and over there. So, yes, you can add branches to this, obviously, to go to the other places. Those are some good places behind me also to make buildings. Uh, the main issue I have with this build, and I wish I had known about it before I made it, and I almost am willing to move it, is that the first thing you're going to see is this looks really stupid like that. Then when the banners come into view, it looks a lot better. So, from here, yeah, there, yeah, 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 I can almost see myself making a gif out of that. <laughs> Alright, yeah, so you get the point. It's a little frustrating seeing that, but inside, I have put an ATM, and it's bone blocks, one stack equals one diamond. That's all I have right now. Um, so I'm going to have to do a lot of AFK in. I got the ATM and some things to do things. And if you just wanted something and this was diamonds, you just leave a diamond for wherever you pick the bone blocks. I don't need to add an extra chest here. If you guys get too confused and you need me to add an extra chest, I will think of something to make you happy. Oh, notifications. But anyways, I am getting ready to record with somebody. This is exciting. New people on the server. And um, I don't know if this video is coming out after or before the one with the introduction of this new person. But I can't wait. So I'm going to work on some redstone for the item elevator. And I think I'm going to make the item elevator out of lanterns. Yeah. So we're going to want to start working on the item elevator uh, to go up there so we can start uh, setting up the chest because all these chests are pretty much full to the top, all five of them. So I think I'm going to have uh, 10 double stacks for each thing that we get out of this farm. So we're going to need a way to bring it up there, which is the item elevator. So um, we're working on this. So like uh, if I throw a whole bunch of stuff in there. It's pretty quick. So what I need to do is make this in the proper place. So I have it marked off over here. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take the, um, excuse me, shush. I am going to take this and I guess I don't have uh, an axe on me. We'll punch the wood in a different manner than that. I know. Actually, this should be up one more block. So let's do this and put that there because um, now this is level with uh, the, the line that's going to come out of here. It's it's going to be level and it's actually on a little good. It's actually in line with it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this, take this. So we have the comparator coming out. Then we have this. And let's go get the redstone. I have this torch, and we'll leave those there because I'm just gonna need to make a hopper line. I just kind of wanted to do a little bit of redstone on camera because in all the videos I have made in my Minecraft uh, time, I have not done much redstone on camera, and that's partially because. It's kind of a pain in the behind to do on camera. So uh, we just wrap that around and I'm guessing, oh, uh, I guess I should get a hopper just so I can make sure this works okay. This would power this hopper, wouldn't it? Let's see if it does. Oh no, okay. I was thinking that redstone torch might power that hopper, but it doesn't. Okay, because if this thing's powered, it's not gonna go. So I'm going to get to work with this and I'm going to put the pillar up to the top from here and um, probably in a time lapse.
As you saw with the last time lapse, I had created this little pillar of light. That's what I'm calling it. Don't know if it's going to stay like this, but it is something that's here now. Initially, I think I was going to have the um, product come over here and have the items sort of going that way. I'm thinking of maybe pushing it that way, moving the uh, water to go that way and have the chest over here just for room's sake, because this is... I don't know, I might encapsulate this, but right now I think I should make this platform a little bit bigger, and that's a good excuse to do that. But first, I'm going to show you what I've done with the bone shop. I have completely completed it. <laughs> you like that? Completely completed. So let's go. I don't know if you've uh, <laughs> seen <clears throat> my streams and videos and stuff, but uh, this dog has been down here for a long time, and... Oh, actually, that's a new dog. That's a different dog. I think the dog that I was seeing over here was had a black collar, so... But now we've got a dog perch here. Hmm, interesting. Alright, so here is the bone shop. I gotta come up with a nice name for it. I'm gonna get some skeletons and throw them in here and protect them with glass. So you have some skeletons here. Um, that's probably why I've been carrying around those two name tags. I've been going, why am I carrying these two name tags for? Well, basically, bone blocks, one stack, one diamond. I don't know. I had um, ten sold ten earlier, um, but I've kind of been filling it up slowly. I need to, you know, as you see fill it up a lot more but I'm not too worried about it I wanted to get this um, item elevator done first but this is all done guys so come and get it come and get it I actually already said it in the uh, discord so they know it's here they know it's here I'm putting down the chest. I'm basically going to have five, six. No, I'm going to have six. Oh, crap. I got to make another 20 chests. I don't know. I'm going to throw some chests down, and I'm going to see if I can... F what is this not wanting? Oh, you know what? When you make trap chests, it's always a good idea to actually make them into trapped chests. You know what's funny? I've been on this server for... A good six months. I just got the weirdest achievement. Parrots and the bats breed two animals together. <laughs> I've been mostly stealing chicken from Arch and uh, using fish from my fishing farm. And I just bred some cows for a reason around the corner here. That thing is an item at a litter. And it goes up to just the water source, pushes it over, and goes, does the item sort of thing. Almost. But we needed to mark these. And so I know what's in each one. First, we have to actually make the item sorter. So it's time to set with the filters for the item separator or sorter. And to go along with the labels I got down there. So you make a block that you don't think that will be picked up from down below in the mob farm. And I don't think any mobs uh, drop any uh, flint called Sparky, so I'm pretty sure I'm safe. I can go like that. We can throw the bottle there. So basically the bottle will go into this one. And we just continue going like that. The sugar, I kind of have these in order, so I'm lucky that I, I'm hopefully sorting this right. But if not, I just need to change one thing down below. As you see, um, the hoppers and everything here are a little bit overloaded. Jeez, those witches scared me. But anyways, as you see, this is overwhelmed. So all I gotta do is connect there and there. And stuff should start going up north. Let's see. Now this is working. We lost a little bit there. We don't see anything coming out from the sides. Hopefully it's working properly. We have a little treasure hunt ahead of us, so let's go check out what it's all about. Sharing some luck with those who look. 
All right, so in here, ah, I thought it was that easy. Solve my riddle and find your gold. See, it kind of looks like a, a, um, a bucket of gold. So I guess she was saying. Uh, so here's all the people on the server. Some people have taken theirs. Uh, kind of googly. So we got Protovault, Bendo, Jam, Doogie, Kind of googly, Laser Minecrafter, Foxtails, me, Lord Rip, the Rip, Family Craft Dad, Ninja, Zanza, who is Garden Bunny's other, and the Accountant. So let's take mine and see what our clue is. Or KMA's Corner, a vacation for you to the warm southwest tropics, white sandy beaches on a large island, isolated and free and hard to see. If you make this trip, you are sure to never to return from this trip of isolation for while you yearn. So, um, Southwest Tropics, that's where I live now. I live in Southwest Florida, which is <laughs> actually the farthest northern tropic town in America. So let's go Southwest and see what we can find. Uh, which way is Southwest? South, east, southwest. So we go southwest to white sandy beaches on a large island, isolated and free and hard to see. If you make this trip, okay. So we're gonna go look for an island to the southwest. And if I see anything, I will be right back with you. I think I'm gonna go grab a bed. I can't use color. Here we go. I've been flying in the um, southwest for a little bit, and oh my gosh, look at this. <laughs> this is freaking awesome. Oh, let me go over. There's a, um, there's a chest over here. I was so close. I was, I've been looking for like 20 minutes. I was so close. I was so close, but... Um, just a minute. Here's Hop and Rip has a grip. Uh, a bit of gold, a sight to behold. Here's Hop and Rip has a good grip. All right. Do I have a good grip? Oh, this might be Lord Rips. This might be Rips, not mine. So we did confirm that this was Lord Rips. <laughs> and look at this. There's a pot of gold here. I wonder if this is mine. This, this. I kind of, I kind of actually hope it's mine. A bit of gold, a sight to behold, just four corner, true gold hoarder. Nice. So this is mine. Um, let's let's go see what we have in here. Ooh. Oh, jeez. Oh, it's filled with uh, glass. Oh, I thought that was small. What, what are you? Black concrete. Okay. <gasps> Look at the gold. What is this? So touch. So touch. Okay. I do want to uh, get some gold ore. Because it's good for decorating. Oh, and look at all this gold. Nice, and we get yellow glass. Um, I have a friend who uh, makes videos called Fizzbo. Bolt Fizz Bolt. And her favorite color is yellow. She must really like the gold. Uh, actually, I'll put up a card in the um, upper right. Go follow her. She, she makes some good content, and she's one of my moderators. <laughs> so... Um, what I'm gonna do is I am gonna go and head back to spawn. I'm gonna finish my project. See you there. That's working. I gotta make, uh, make it look a little bit better, but it is working. I would also like to thank Garden Bunny for the awesome St. Patrick's Day stuff. Hey guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, hit the like. If you want, subscribe. If you don't. Whatever. I prefer to have you here, though. More the merrier. 
And uh, we'll see what we can do next time. I think I'm going to decorate this place a little bit more and do another farm. Maybe move this sucker behind me because now this is a... Ugh, that looks bad. And obviously, I still got to do something about that tree. Goodbye.